I've been clearing a lot of brush on my property and I found quite a bit of poison ivy so I just wanted to show everybody what it looks like. Right here is poison ivy and I'm in Michigan so this is kind of common to uh, to the area. They also have poison oak around here and sometimes I think it just gets confused with poison ivy because right here that to me looks like an oak leaf but that is actually a poison ivy plant compared to the one right next to it there. You can see a lot of this dead brown stuff because I've been trying to spray the the poison ivy roundup on on this stuff but it keeps coming back. It's that uh, invasive here. Then you see the typical uh, saying is leaves of three let it be. You can see this one has three leaves. Um, but right over here there's another plant with leaves of three and this is just some sort of wild raspberry, some sort of bramble. So it looks similar but that is not poison ivy where this stuff right here is. And I'm going to take you over and show you some poison ivy that is actually like an ivy. It's growing up a tree. Most of the stuff I see around my place is low growing. But here I found one that See, there's the poison ivy leaves, but that's growing. It's probably almost four foot high on this tree trunk, growing like an actual ivy. So it can come in different forms. But whatever you want to do is avoid that. Even if you've never gotten it, I never got poison ivy until about 10 years ago when I was weed whacking some brush with shorts on which was a mistake but I came down with poison ivy rash so bad that that time and now I get it just by brushing up against it so you can become sensitized to it so be cautious so one of the other characteristics that I've noticed is that the middle leaf of poison ivy is symmetrical whereas the outer leaves have that odd lobe out there on the outside and not on the inside but they don't always have that so you can see on this very same plant those leaves right there barely have any lobes and that is all poison ivy this is growing up this tree about four foot up as an actual vine. Here we have a plant that has similar leaves to poison ivy and it grows in the same locations only this has five leaves on it so this is not poison ivy. Okay this plant here has three leaves similar shape uh, it even has a red stem, which is sometimes a characteristic of poison ivy. But this is actually a wild strawberry. And I know that for sure because this spring there was little tiny strawberries all over back here. So this is not poison ivy. So hopefully this helps you identify poison ivy and helps you to avoid it. Thanks for watching.